Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today in this video we are going to talk about different types of forest in India. India has a diverse range of forest from the rainforest of Kerala in the south to the alpine pastures of Ladakh in the north, from the deserts of Rajasthan in the west to the evergreen forest in the northeast. The climate, soil type, topography and elevation are the main factors that determine the type of forest. Forests are classified according to their nature and composition, the type of climate in which they thrive and their relationship with the surrounding environment. Now let's talk about different types of forests found in India. Moving forward, the first one is the coniferous forest. Coniferous forests grow in the Himalayan mountain region where the temperatures are low. These forests have tall stately trees with needle-like leaves and downward sloping branches so that the snow can slip off the branches. They have cones instead of seeds and are called gymnosperms. The next one is the broadleaf forest. These forests have several types such as evergreen forest, deciduous forest, thrown forest and mangrove forest. Broadleaf forests have large leaves of various shapes. The next in the series is the evergreen forest. These forests grow in high rainfall areas of the Western Ghats, Northeast India and the Andaman and Nicobar Islands. These forests grow in areas where monsoon lasts for several months. The trees overlap with each other to form a continuous canopy, thus very little light penetrates down to the forest floor. Only a few shade-loving plants can grow in the ground layer in areas where some light filters down from the closed canopy. The forest is rich in orchids and ferns. The barks of the tree are covered in moss and the forest abounds in animal life and is most rich in insect life. The next one is the wet evergreen forest. These forests are found in south along the western Ghats and the Nicobar and Andaman Islands and all along the northeastern region. It is characterized by tall straight evergreen trees that have a buttressed trunk or root on three sides like a tripod that helps to keep a tree upright during a storm. These trees often rise to a great height before they open out like a cauliflower. The most common trees that are found here are the jackfruit, the beetle nut palm, jamun, mango and hollock. The trees of these forests form a tried pattern scrubs over the layer close to the ground followed by short structured trees and the, the tall variety. Beautiful ferns of various colors and different variety of orchids grow on the trunks of the trees. The next one is semi evergreen forest. Semi evergreen forests are found in the western Ghats, Andaman and Nicobar Islands and the eastern Himalayas. Such forests have a mixture of the wet evergreen trees and the moist deciduous trees. The forest is dense and is filled with a large variety of trees of both types. The next one is deciduous forest. These forests are found in regions with a moderate amount of seasonal rainfall that lasts for only a few months. Most of the forest in which teak trees grow are of this type. The deciduous trees shed their leaves during the winter and hot summer months. In March or April, they regain their fresh leaves just before the monsoon when they grow vigorously in response to the rains. Thus, these are periods of leaf fall and canopy regrowth. The forest frequently has thick undergrowth as the light can penetrate easily onto the forest floor. The next one is the thorn forest. These forests are found in the semi-arid regions of India. The trees which are sparsely distributed are surrounded by open grassy areas. Thorny plants are called xerophytic species and are able to conserve water. Some of these trees have small leaves while other species have thick waxy leaves to reduce water losses during transpiration. Thorn forest trees have long or fibrous roots to reach water at great depths. Many of these plants have thorns which reduce water loss and protect them from herbivores. Now let's talk about mangrove forest. Mangrove forests grow along the coast especially in the river deltas. These plants are able to grow in a mix of saline and fresh water. 
they grow luxuriantly in muddy areas covered with silt that the rivers have brought down. The mangrove trees have breathing roots that emerge from the mud banks. So this was all about today's video. If you like the video then please do like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching and have a good day.